प्लीज क्लिक ऑन सब्सक्राइब बटन एंड क्लिक ऑन बेल आइकन फॉर मोर इंटरेस्टिंग अपडेट्स ऑन सिविल इंजीनियरिंग कॉन्सेप्ट इन दिस वीडियो लेक्चर आई विल एक्सप्लेन यू कंप्लीट फाउंडेशन रेनफोर्समेंट डिटेल्स फॉर द रेस्पेक्टेड जी प्लेस वन बिल्डिंग विच इज रिलेटेड टू द नॉर्थ फेसिंग डायरेक्शन सो इन माई प्रीवियस वीडियो आई वॉज एक्सप्लेन द कॉलम रेनफोर्समेंट डिटेल्स एंड बीम रेनफोर्समेंट डिटेल्स एंड स्टेर केसेस रेनफोर्समेंट डिटेल्स फॉर द रेस्पेक्टेड जी प्लेस वन बिल्डिंग विच इज प्लेस इन नॉर्थ फेसिंग डायरेक्शन सो इन दिस वीडियो आई विल कवर द कॉन्सेप्ट विच इज रिलेटेड टू द फाउंडेशन सेक्शन ओके सो इनिशियली आई विल शो यू द टिपिकल फ्लोर प्लान फॉर दट रेस्पेक्ट section so click on this pdf option so click on this typical floor plan this is a typical floor plan for this respected building so i was already explained this respected typical floor plan details and the column reinforcement details and beam reinforcement details and the staircases reinforcement details already in my previous video i will provide you that respected video links in above cart link you can watch that respected videos okay so click on another pdf click on this pdf option so this is the diagram which is related to the foundation design reinforcement details so it will be consisting of the column sizes of 12 inches cross 24 inches for the one column section and 9 inches cross 24 inches is the second column 9 inches cross 21 inches is the third column and 9 inches cross 12, 14 inches is the fourth column so for this respect to all sections the reinforcement values are also different okay so firstly i will explain you the reinforcement details for this respected column 1 which is having 12 inches cross 24 inches okay so it will be consisting of the three number of the columns will be exist with this dimensions of section okay so this is the reinforcement details values for this respected uh, column section so this is the diagram which is related to your respected foundation design okay so for this foundation we are taking the m15 grade concrete which is consisting of the mix proportion of 1 is to 4 is to 8 okay so for this respected column section 1 which is having the dimensions of 12 inches cross 14 inches we are taking the uh, dimensions of the footing as 7 inches cross 7 inches area okay so again we are taking the mat this is related to the reinforcing bars which is of 6 feet cross 6 inches in horizontal position and 6 feet cross 6 inches in vertical position for this respected mat okay so for this respected mat we are used the dimensions of the reinforcing bars is 16 mm diameter okay the spacing between the each bar we are spaced at a distance of 5 inches in horizontal position as well as vertical position okay which is nothing but the x axis direction as well as your y axis direction for the respected mesh okay so for this respected column number 1 we are taking the pedestrian which is approximately equal to 15 inches cross 30 inches okay for this respected 15 inches cross 30 inches pedestrian we are taking the uh, dimensions of the ring is approximately 8 mm bars with 12 inches center to center distance okay again we are using the reinforcement values for the respected pedestrian is 10 a uh, number of the bars which is of 12 mm diameter okay so this is the reinforcement values for the respected 12 inches cross 24 inches uh, column foundation section okay now i will explain your reinforcement values for the foundation too which is having the dimensions of 9 inches cross 24 inches which is related to your respected uh, bars of column reinforcement details of 4 bars of 20 mm diameter and 8 bars of uh, 16 mm diameter so for this respected section it is required 16 mm diameter bar with the 5 inches center to center distance in horizontal position as as well as vertical position for this respected mesh okay so for this respected column it is required 6 feet 6 inches cross 6 feet 6 inches is the dimensions of the pit and mat will be taken as 6 feet cross 6 feet so for this respected mat we are taking the pedestrian which is consisting of 12 inches in horizontal and 30 inches in vertical section okay so and the ring section we are followed for this respected pedestrian is 8 mm diameter bar with 12 inches center to center distance okay so now for this respected pedestrian we are follow the reinforcement values are eight number of the bars of 12 mm diameter okay so this is the reinforcement bars which is related to the pedestrian dimensions and which is related to your respected uh, section of uh, horizontal position and vertical position for this respected pit so for this respected pit it is required 14 number of the bars of 16 mm diameter okay so for this respected first number of the foundation which is consisting of 12 inches cross 40 uh, 24 inches column reinforcement details it is required 15 number of the bars of 16 mm diameter in horizontal and vertical now i will show you the reinforcement details for the third foundation section which is related to the dimensions of the column is 9 inches cross 21 inches so for this respected 9 inches cross 21 inches section it is required a uh, pedestrian size of 12 inches cross 30 inches okay and the depth of the, uh, and the dimensions of the foundation we are followed here is 6 feet cross 0 inches and 6 feet cross 0 inches in horizontal vertical so for this respected section it is required 30 number of the bars which is of 16 mm diameter in horizontal section as well as vertical section again for this respected third foundation also we are followed the 
M15 grade concrete for construction of G plus one building. Okay, so for this respected mat, which is having the dimensions of five feet six inches cross five feet six inches, we are taking the 16 mm diameter bar with five inches center to center distance in horizontal position as well as vertical position. Okay, so for this respected section, we are taking the uh, dimensions for the pedestal is approximately 12 inches cross 13 inches. And ring we are followed for this respected pedestal is 8 mm bars with 12 inches center to center distance. And the reinforcement values we are followed for the respected pedestal is approximately 8 mm of the bars of 12 mm dimensions. Okay. Now I will show you the reinforcement details for the foundation number four, which is having the uh, dimensions of the foundation is five feet cross five feet. Okay, and the dimensions of the column is approximately equal to nine inches cross fourteen inches. Okay, which is having two number of the columns for this respected section. So for this respected section, it is required the pedestal dimensions of twelve inches cross twenty one inches. So for this respected section, we are follow the reinforcement values, which is consisting of the ten number of the bars, which is of twelve mm diameter in horizontal position. And vertical position for this respected four feet cross six inches, four feet six inches cross four feet six inches mat. So for this respected mat, we are follow the twelve mm dimension, twelve uh, mm diameter with five inches center to center distance in horizontal position as well as vertical position. Okay. So again, we are taking the pedestal here, which is approximately having dimensions of twelve inches cross twenty one inches. So for this respected twelve inches cross twenty one inches pedestal, we are follow the ring, which is consisting of eight mm diameter bar with the twelve inches center to center distance. Again, we are taking the reinforcement values for the pedestal is approximately eight number of the bars of twelve mm diameter. Okay. So I will. Attach this respected complete reinforcement details in the below description. You can watch that uh, PDF for the reference. Okay, so this is the general cover block diagram, which is consisting of three inches cross three inches cross twenty two point five inches dimensions. So this is also cover which is located for this respected section and wired cover block, which is consisting of the two inches cross two inches cross one point five inches for the column sections. Okay, basically cover is also mandatory for construction of the foundation section. Okay, so now I will show you the Respected uh, dimensions of the bars, footing design dimensions for this respected section. Okay, for the column number one, and which is nothing but the foundation number one, foundation number two, foundation number three, foundation number four. For the footing section, foundation number one, bar length of eight feet six inches. Okay, again for this respected foundation number two, which is related to this respected section, we are followed the bar length of approximately eight feet. Okay, again for the footing number three, which is related to the column number three, we are followed the bar length of approximately seven feet six inches. Okay, so for this respected footing number of four, which is related to the column number four, we are followed the bar length of five feet six inches. Okay, so if you take this respected value of bar length of eight feet six inches, so that it can get the value of six feet six inches as the dimensions. Why? Because we have to bend these respected bars in a uh, horizontal position at the sides which is of 1 feet in left hand side section and 1 feet in right hand side section okay so for this respected first foundation it is having the mat foundation of 6 feet 6 inches so for this respected 6 feet 6 inches we have to add additionally 1 feet 1 feet so that it can get the bar length of 8 feet 6 inches section okay so this is the reinforcement details for this respected footing okay so this is the specification which is showing for this respected footing which is having the soil bearing capacity is 250 kN per square meter and this respected reinforcement values will be applicable for uh, cellar section uh, plus g plus 3 section okay so for this respected section we are taking the hard soil property so m20 grade concrete is specified for this respected section and cover for the column is taken as 40 mm and footings is taken as 50 mm side cover for the footing is taken as 50 mm So these are the notes, all the notes which is related to this respected foundation section. Okay, so you have to follow these respected notes points in order to get the proper strength values, which is related to the curing process, which is which is related to the bar length and bar dimensions, which is related to the machinery equipment, all the things which is related to the. Which is related to the uh, mix and which is related to the labor. So this is the complete reinforcement details for the foundation, which is of G plus one building. We are followed for construction of this respected building. If you have any queries about this respected video, please text me your questions in the below comment box. I will try to give answer for the respected questions.